How you doing, everybody? It is well, not too far away from the Saturday night party time, and I always have. But today's look is brought to you by my under eye wrinkles. I guess I kind of did a smoky look today. I mean, I, I like never do that because I don't want to look like either a raccoon or I got punched in the eye or something. But I don't have foundation on, but I do have concealer in it. It's one I've been trying to use up for about, I don't know, a month. But in the corner of my eye, I have the Jumbo Eye Pencil from NYX and Milk. Seems like to be a, f a favor of people. On my eyelid, I have the Maybelline Color Tattoo Eye Chrome, and I still can't figure it out. Bronze Sheen. And over that, I have. I put the Danger color from the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani palette. That lovely dark blue one. Usually, I was trying to wear it as a liner, but it went on as eyeshadow instead. So. And they say you shouldn't. What's it called? If you're gonna do a smoky eye, do a neutral lip. And over that, I have my Cat Find Day Tattoo Liner of Awesomeness and Tripper. I still have my liner. And I know I'm definitely. The next time I'm in Ulta or Sephora, I'm going to buy like five of them for backups. Because the ones in the drugstore are not the same. And mascara, I have Lancome Hypnos Drama, of course. And the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani lipstick and spider web. I don't know why the Gwen stuff is limited edition because the last time I was in Sephora I was looking for to see if they had any left but online they're, they marked them down to like I don't know really cheap so someday when I'm allowed to order stuff again I'm, that's what I'm going to do or go to the regular Urban Decay, the new Urban Decay stuff that came out recently. Because they put the Gwen stuff back in there with those things. But it's sort of my Saturday Night Smoky Eye. Now, I don't usually do a smoky eye, but like I said, but I don't know. I want to use try to use more of these colors because some people don't like the palette for some reason I mean I like buttery and it's Gwen of course I have a Gwen t-shirt that my best friend Tommy when she went to see her like 10 years ago lucky duck I have her doll I have perfume the palette and the lipstick and a bunch of other stuff. pictures of her somewhere on this wall if I can find one. Hold on. I see there's a bunch of them. But you know besides the ones that are my friends and stuff. And celebrities and uh, I can't find one. That's interesting. I have a bunch of wear in this one there. 
I guess I know, I've said this in my videos lately, but if I ever have my own room, I'm gonna have a celebrity wall. I'm gonna put Gwen on like half of it at least. It's pretty much the same pictures I have here on my walls now. Now, a couple of years ago, when I lived at that transitions place, which I didn't particularly like, and I only lasted about six weeks, I had in another place last year, I think it was, I had pictures there, and then I moved them back here. So, I'm not sure where those pictures are now. But I did put a picture of Gwen from Entertainment Weekly. So it's good that she came back and you know, she went through a lot last year with her divorce and stuff and divorce is tough, you know. It's hard to keep moving my phone around and a bunch of books I want to read. So, I should do a video on like my favorite books. And then it's now, and I'm gonna do that video. So, I'll see everybody shortly. Have a lovely weekend, everybody. Sorry about that. Ciao.